So stall. Now he's going to spin it on the left wing. Once, twice to recover. Kick opposite rudder. This is another John Williams. We'll back on the stick at 130 miles an hour for the loop. I've got a CD of Continental seven cylinder engine. Yes. Snap roll the top of the loop makes it an avalanche. Nicely cut there by Dave Cunn. Kicking that thing around, huh? Doesn't that look like fun? These rides are for sale. Straight up, the wind's blowing him in our direction. He's going to have to use a lot of left rudder coming around. Right rudder right now. Left rudder when he comes back is a uh, keep it eight. Now right rudder. Get over there. Up we go. First flown yes. by Lynn Tovey in 1934, constructed for the Cuban Air Force. Now look at that, holding upside down. Very nicely done. Cross because it ran out of fuel. Eight point roll. Two, three, four, five, six. Hard left rudder. Seven. Eight point and 45 degrees of peace. Huge Martin Airplane Show coming up next Saturday and Sunday. The DCRC will be out here putting on the most incredible demonstration you've ever seen in your life. Saturday's the best day, but Sunday is also a good one. Slow roll to the left. Gravity feed fuel system can't keep the fuel flowing. They get a cough. Imperceptible amount of back pressure on the stick, but just a little bit of fuel flowing. He feels that in the seat. That's how he does that. Very low, so we need lots of speed. We're gonna do anything. Four pointer. Three. One left button. Perfectly button. Eight combination though. You'll never see any better. With a primary trainer. Normally you need a nimble aerobatic airplane like a pit special or an extra 300 or the MSS that we have out here. But Dave Carr puts on a tremendous performance with just a primary trainer doing very, very precise maneuvers. He's getting some altitude to demonstrate a real dogfighting maneuver. He will first of all demonstrate a snap roll, a complete snap roll, where you yank the stick at just the right entering speed. The entering speed is different from every airplane, from the Uber. He's going to yank the stick hard back to the left corner, left quadrant. He's going to yank it. And then he's going to do a half a snap, and then he's going to split S. There's the snap roll. And now, a half of a snap. And now, Pulling back on the stick, the enemy's over to the left. We're going to shoot it. We're going to come down. Lots of airspeed. We got it. And a victory roll. A loop, I should say. You can see the wind pushing it back to the south. Fantastic. He's not done yet. He's going to come back and do a, a very amazing maneuver for you. He's the only guy in the world. Well, he, he and his brother both do this. We're going to see Dave come back, and what he's going to do, he won't shut the engine off, he's not going to taxi straight over there. He's going to come right here where I am, right in front of us, and he will, you will see when he lands right now, he's going to hold the tail up. He will hold the tail up. And when he gets in front of us, I'm going to keep my hat over here because it's going to blow. I'm crazy. All right, there's a short, okay, that's a short field landing on the uphill. That's perfectly done there by Dave, nicely done. Then he can come out of that, and he's going to hold the tailwheel up, which he's doing, and just enough brakes to not nose over. Oh, but he's not done yet. He's going to come over here and demonstrate a 360 degree turn with the tailwheel held up. He'll be using nearly full throttle of this demonstration. That's almost full throttle right there. Very critical. He's about to begin.
Alex Cress, I did